All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at DNS walk. And again, we're taking this from the backtrack information gathering, network analysis, DNS analysis, and from here, we're going to DNS walk. Now, DNS walk, very straightforward. All you really do is you put in the DNS walk with the domain name and make sure you put a dot behind the com or edu, whatever it is you're using. Now, when you get an error like this, it's actually pretty common on, on some of these tools. Um, you can actually initiate it by going through uh, the dot slash DNS walk and then putting in the mile2.com address. You can see here it's actually working, going through, and so forth. So here we have, um, again, trying to get the zone transfer information from mile2 from our NS1 server. And it's getting our SOA record, pointing us to our name server 1, and also a contact at emergency.mile2.com. It also mentions that there's a large FTP, mile2.com, with an A record of 64.91.238.220, and has no pointer record. So you can see the information that comes through is pretty straightforward, but it doesn't give us a whole lot of information but it does give us some information. So again, try this out with your own domain, uh, with the domain of your target, and see what information you come back with.